Excel 2030, we have a new function called number value. And what number value will do will convert text to a number. Now you've already got the value function that's been in Excel for donkey's years that does that same thing. But this is a little bit cleverer because what it's going to do is going to be able to pick out this foreign punctuation in our text here. So I've got a full stop as like a thousand separator there and I've got a comma as a decimal point. Um, so this is kind of like a foreign punctuation for my numbers here. Um, I want to convert this text. It's recognized as text at the moment. You can see it's left aligned in the cell. I want to convert this text to a number. So here we go. Uh, let's look for this function. Number value. There we are. Just double click on him there. And Control A opens up your function arguments dialog box. So you've got three arguments here. First one text. So what is the text you want to convert? Then it asks for the decimal separator. So at the moment, my decimal separator, the thing that tells me where the decimal point is, is a comma. So I put in a comma. The group separator is like a thousand separators. And at the moment, a full stop is being used for that character. So that's all I need to do. Click on OK. It converts the text to a number. I'm just going to copy that down. Works fine. I'm going to do a little bit of formatting here. Use my comma style format. You can see it's just swapped around the punctuation there. Uh, this one's quite interesting because this has got some spaces in it, but it's still coped with it. Just thought I'd show you that one. A space after the three, a space after the zero, still converted it to a number. This one had two percent signs after the number, so it's ended up dividing nine by a hundred and then dividing that by a hundred again to give us this answer here. Okay, that's the number value function.